<clears throat> I think we're gonna make it. I think we're gonna make it. Ah, oh, nice. Finally got that guy hacked. Hey everyone, Revan here, and welcome back to Dig Site. Where today we're gonna be continuing on with completing up all of the quests, and then hopefully meeting up with Slater so we can get all set to do the final raid. So sit back, enjoy the video, and let's see what we can't get done. Well, as you saw from the first clip, I was finally, after many, many attempts, able to hack that last security terminal that we have down in the ranch. So uh, if we go back here and head on down, to, hopefully we can make a piece that we need uh, for our jetpack because we need some advanced tubing, I think it's called. Let me see here. I'm sorry, not the jetpack, but the, the jet boots. We need advanced pressure tubes. Okay, so I finally got this working. Apparently, this guy did not like being off in the corner. So I had to put him in the same spot over here <laughs> as everybody else. So I thought they could work from a diagonal as long as they were within one block uh, because that's how it was set up. And most of the tutorials that I saw... Uh, or I should say pictures, because I think the only good tutorial I saw was in German. And I don't speak German, uh, but had it set up like that, where the you had the laser and then the drill right next to each other. So, but that should do what it's got to do, so we can go back up to the surface. All right, so let's see if these guys, how long it takes for these guys to come through. Because after them, let's see, we're gonna need. The advanced air thing, which all we need is the advanced pressure tubes for. Uh, let's see. These vortex cannons shouldn't be an issue. We are going to have to go out and find some dandelions. There we go. Hopefully five will be enough. You guys ordered up yet? No. Yes. All right. Let's head back over to our AE system. So let's see here. These guys, what are we missing? Actually, this we should be able to make. All right, we'll toss the dandelions in there. We don't need these right now. And we can toss the rest of these guys in here. So we need two air canisters. I think we have enough, just enough pipes. But no. Oh, we need uh, ba -ba 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 levers. Two. And I think we can just, yeah, toss you in here and toss you in there. Now, if we come over here, do we need these guys to be pressurized? I'm hoping not. Oh, do we? I think, yeah, I probably have to put it into the charging station here which means we got to turn all of these guys back on and then wait for this guy to charge up. So I'll bring you guys back. This is going to take a long time to get both of these guys charged up here. So I'll be back once that's done. All right. Well, we got these two guys filled up. What I ended up doing was using this advanced compressor here just because the one downstairs was just taking so ungodly long. So just going to use this. And then we're going to use it in our recipe anyway, so we can just take this guy back. Um, I am still a little bit concerned about the shulker for the, um, uh, what's the word and stuff that I'm thinking of the quest line for the pristine matter, but, uh, we'll, we'll see what happens with that. Is this, oh, are you kidding me? <laughs> it's just under, okay. 10 bars. All right. <clears throat> don't go anywhere now uh, we can put our water back okay let's try this one more time <laughs> toss you in there and you in there and we have our jetpack boots what about our armor jetpack i know we have a jetpack in here mechanism does not like registering its own recipes so for this we just need a little bit of bronze which was copper and tin inside of a metallurgic infuser which i ended up having to do Wow. <laughs> I had to make one and just 
toss it in there because these guys down here didn't want to accept the recipe. Maybe it's because I'm a derp. I'm not really sure. All right. So we have completed. Let's see here. Uh, we still need some of the end material. We still need to go through these guys over here. But uh, let's see. Uh, inventory. We still going to need to make a remote crafter. Uh, we can toss you on and we're going to need. Yeah, we, I know we don't have any stone in the system, so just craft up some stone there and we'll add this to our list. Not what we wanted. I think it was storage remote. Yeah. <laughs> so what are we what are we going to be missing from here? Thank you. Thank you. Let's see. We do. Oh, we're going to need a hopper. Ooh, are we out of iron? Add that to the the crafting recipes. We'll just throw the cobblestone in in case we need it. Coal. We don't need this glass. We don't need these guys anymore. This we can toss in. Uh, this we're not going to need. All right, we have our hopper and storage input cables. So why are we only showing two of those? All right, we need export. So piston. All right, there we have those. And what are we missing? We need another storage cable. So need a few more stone slabs. Go. And last thing we need is gold. All right, so we have our storage remote. And the next thing we need is the upgraded storage remote. So we're going to need glowstone and magma blocks. So we're going to have to and another storage network master. No, we're going to have to go back to the ranch to get to get supplies for that. So is there anything else in here that we can actually make? Obviously, mob learning. This is all this stuff. So like I said, the gas mat, the gas, I think I can get by trading up uh, to get another module. And then we're going to have to trade in some cucumbers uh, to spawn in a couple gas. Uh, the wither we already have uh, the I'm sorry, the wither skeleton. We already have the pristine wither matter. We're going to need to spawn in probably a couple because I'm not sure how we're going to, you know, get this up to basic tier <laughs> uh, from faulty without without having to take on a couple withers. Let's see. Is there anything in the weapons department that's done? That's done. Logistics is done. Uh, inventory. We can do a 1K, I think. Let's just craft you up. Are we going to be missing anything? No. All right. We'll start him up. So in the meantime, let's head back to the ranch. We look back here at the mob learning. Our next pristine matter that we need to get is going to be gassed. And in order to make a gas module, you need a gas tier, which, you know, we could have made, but I think. What are you requiring? You're requiring uh, blaze and extraterrestrial and grab our ghast. Let's see. You did you have ghast eggs? No. So how are we supposed to level up this data module? Oh, it's our it comes at basic. OK, that's good to know. Let's turn you guys off for now. All right. So we we'll have to let this guy run. And then, you know, that should hopefully eventually give us a gas. When we have the rogue, we have hellish matter, which we can actually put right back in there. Uh, let's see. As far as the end stone. Yeah, that's just an ender pearl and some sandstone. All right. Sandstone just still for sand. Yes, it is. So if we come like this. 
we toss in our ender pearl and our extraterrestrial matter we get end stone <laughs> nice so that finishes off our first tab here uh we have the second one and so we just are waiting for this to finish and then this we're gonna need magma and glowstone let's go back down and see what we need for that i think the magma might be the blaze let's see so we're still waiting on the pristine gas and then we're gonna have to grab a wither and then wither matter and we get that through the data module which is a nether star so we're gonna need two wither skeleton heads uh let's just grab a few of you and we're gonna say we want two of you so soul sand is just sand and hellish matter five sand and where did you go five hellish matter all right so we have plenty of soul sand if we can find where we came out of <laughs> i'm already lost all right since we are here i'm gonna hook this up for now um, to try to give us a little bit more power for these guys because it's taking too long with just the just the good old sunshine all right we finally got our blaze so we can take him out and oh we had an extra blaze on us the entire time wow we're gonna grab this magma block that'll go into our system so we're still waiting on the gas and oh yep we we have the gas pristine gas matter so now we can just be able to yep it completed the wither since we have that on us and so now we just need to get the pristine wither matter which means we're going to have to go on a little bit of a journey here let's just toss i'm actually curious what 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 would you give me gas tier obsidian dust plutonium huh. Actually, since we don't really need the gas matter for anything, instead of making another star, we're just going to take this pristine gas, gas matter and 16 of our hellish. And we should be able to trade for a wither data module. And that comes as tier basic as well. But we'll take you out and toss you in there. So then we just have to wait for that guy to complete. Um, but after the wither matter it's the shulker and i have no idea where we're supposed to get the pristine shulker <laughs> uh because according to this the only way we can get this is with a shulker shell the only way we can get a shulker shell is either by killing a shulker which according to uh the instruct the mod pack says that it spawns anywhere in the world i have yet to see one and yeah we can't get to the end so <laughs> I'm not, uh, I'm not really sure. Uh, you know, at first I was thinking, okay, well, maybe we need a shulker, you know, shulker egg, but, oh, he does. So we need trap chests. Okay. Wow. I could, I could have swore I checked that guy already. Let's go grab some trap, tra yeah, trapped chests. All right. We can take the gas guy out. We're going to toss our enderman back in because we're going to need more of these pristine endermen because i think we're only going to be able to get two of two of the shulkers one two all right so now i think if we spawn you all right we have our shell now let's grab some overworld overworld in matter I always forget how many we need. Should be able to grab another blank data module. And nice. This guy is faulty. Um, so let's, <laughs> before we spawn this guy in, because it's expensive, uh, let's make sure we add him to our deep learner. And... Uh, cross you, and hopefully we get... All right, so we did get two, so we need to get one more of these, which means we're gonna need uh, at least one more of the pristine matter for the Enderman. So I'm gonna wait until that gets back up and then we can toss this guy into our deep mob learner. All right, we reached basic tier on the, 
on the data pad for the shulker so it's just, now it's just going to be a matter of tossing this guy in and waiting for waiting for it to kick out some pristine matter uh let's see we're still waiting on wither let's see if we got any we did nice and what does this stuff give us uh it gives us a dislocator and a nether star so we're gonna hold on to that because i'm not sure what we're gonna need that for and then we have the the gas matter up there so then the last thing we need is the shulker and then the ender dragon let's see how do we how do we get the ender dragon data we need a dragon egg which comes is this something i can trade you for no so where am i supposed to get an end dragon maybe the pristine shulker matter gives me it gives me a dragon egg i'm not really sure and there is our shulker matter awesome so if we toss this guy eh, let's take you off oh you just give me diamonds i mean you're valuable but don't in any way shape or form help me with the dragon egg so i gotta believe that the ender dragon egg is something that we're probably gonna find uh in, in the final boss boss raid it's the only thing that i can think of um because yeah it's it's telling me the only get way to get it is from pristine ender dragon matter and the only way to get pristine ender dragon matter is from a ender dragon data module and the only way to get the ender dragon data module is going to be with a dragon egg and so unless i missed one of you guys doesn't look like it yeah i gotta believe we're just kind of out of luck on that so let's toss this back first go back to the base hello and try to collect some of these quests and then see what we are left with just go like this and then go run through our achievements here so we completed this first page here that is all good grab us up some food i am going through these one by one because it always kind of slightly annoyed me <laughs> in uh watching other people play mod mod packs when they just you know click the apple up here or whatever and just take all of them at once because then you never really get a full grasp of all the quests that they they completed so we got that guy getting a lot of books Toss all of you guys in here these guys will take down so that we can we can use them so we're at four hearts five hearts is that the most we can do uh, i guess we're maxed out at five hearts a lot of xp Kind of feel like if they're going to give you all of those books of, of absorption you should be able to use them um yeah but i guess if you are playing this pack with more than one one person because i believe this pack is designed to be up to four players it would it would make sense all right so let's see what we can't complete here so we need the diamond respirator that's completed we need a ton of prevention so we're gonna need this diamond filter uh diamond vacuum that might be a little bit difficult and or diamond vacuum bag so we're gonna need i think we're running out of storage here <laughs> let's grab 1k and we we can just toss this down here forgot we we made that for the quest yeah that's full so we'll just toss that in and that should allow us to toss some more items into the system Oop. all right so can we make the you no we need glass panes can we make you no can we make glass all right 
grab our glass panes. Now can we make you? Yes, we have the diamond filter. Can we make one of you? No. What about now? We have five because we're going to need a repeater as well. All right, we have our comparator, our repeater, and we have a piece of stone in here. <laughs> like I'm making as little as I possibly can. Okay, I did have a piece of stone, so why wouldn't it let me make you? All right, what are you missing? Block of diamond. Oh, that's... That's going to be difficult. There we go. All right, so we have that, and we're going to need more leather. Do we... I think we still have some rotten flesh. We'll just load you into the furnaces here to make us some leather, because in this pack, rotten flesh in a furnace makes leather. We have our tunic and we're missing a slime ball. All right, there is our slime ball and our diamond vacuum pump. So now we are just missing a pollution pump, which is going to be more diamond and an arrow meter. So do we have everything? What are we missing? Stone, two more repeaters. Two more comparators. Uh, a compass. And hopefully that's it. Yep, we have our arrow meter. Now we just need to make our pollution pump, which we are now missing a block of redstone. And that should be it. Yep. Oh, and then the last thing is this pump pipe, which is just going to be four iron and that is an easy day for us. There we go. We can toss all of this good stuff back into the system. And that should finish off the climate page for us. That's all of those. And then we have this is complete. And then, so we just need the upgraded storage module, which I think we should have everything we need now. What are we missing? Um, just grab up some more of our quartz here and toss this stuff back in. Went back and had to get some food. I was starving and that was bad. All right, you, you can go in storage device. Need four of you guys. And there is our storage network master. And we just need two gold ingots. And we'll just run that, run that through. And then that should complete that. This guy, we might as well toss in our, in our system. Trying to keep an eye on our Eulorium here. We're not burning through it very quickly, but it is getting there. All right. We now have our upgraded storage remote, which means we can access that from anywhere as soon as we link it, which will be nice. And we get some XP for that. So the only thing we haven't completed is mob farming and Easter eggs. Uh, yeah, so I'm not really sure what to do about that since, you know, we obviously <laughs> can't get the dragon egg, um, but these guys, we can take over to Slater real quick and get what we're going to need. So next episode, we can actually progress in the storyline Wait, so I'll see you when we get to Slater. All right, we're here at our man Slater. Doma arigato, Mr. Roboto, da 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 core, quantum shrink, sound tight, drop power. All right, so <laughs> we should be able to take this. We get the nuke, we get the worm, and we get the personal shrinking device. Nice. Does he say anything after that? Um... Don't think so. 
So what does my quest say? All right, so we need to enter the core, find a security node, use the virus and then hack. So these are all the things that we still need. Um, I'm hoping, like I said, that the pristine ender dragon matter is somewhere in this end section. Um, we also, we did not find a high capacity battery, Mr. Snuggles or Robbie. Uh, so I'm hoping that we find these guys as well. Cause I thought I did a pretty good job of checking out all the villages and locations. Um, but I'll, I'll probably in between episodes, I'll probably give them another thorough look through just to make sure that we didn't miss anything because normally, uh, they're not too difficult to find. They'll be uh, under chests or stuff like that. Um, I'm trying to see if I can find a location that, that makes sense as to what I'm saying. Uh, like a lot of times, if you see an anvil or a bed, check underneath it because they like placing things there. And yeah, but we're going to have to call it an episode there, guys. We did get a lot done today. We almost finished up the entire quest line. A few more things we need to check off. But next episode, we're going to be raiding Sibes. So if you enjoyed the video, please give a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed yet, hopefully I earned it today. And as always, stay safe, be awesome, and we'll see you guys next time.